Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So we've just had a quick look at the Global Stats Survey results by StatCounter for August of 2024 for the desktop browser market share. And that video will be linked down below in the end screen. And now it's time to have a look at the desktop Windows version market share and do a quick comparison between July and August. Now, just like the desktop browser market share, we have a 50-50 split. We have three that have increased and we have three that have decreased. So an even playing field with the decrease and increase of those different market shares. Now, Windows 8 has actually increased from 0.24 to 0.28%. Windows XP has also increased from 0.38% to 0.4% and I think that Windows XP we might have a surprise next month. I think it's going to outpace Windows 8.1 gaining very close and getting very close to Windows 8.1 and by the way Windows 8.1 has fallen from 0.42% to 0.41%. Windows 7 has decreased very slightly from 3.04% to 3.03%. Windows 11 is at an all-time best, which has moved up from 30.82% to 31.62%. And I think the reason for that is that there are a couple of reasons, actually. The first is that Windows 10 end of support is starting to get closer now. According to Microsoft, that support will end next year in October 2025. So I think um, a lot of people, if they can and meet the system requirements, are starting to move on now to Windows 11. So that's one reason. I think another reason is back in June, Microsoft rolled out Copilot plus PCs. And then I think another reason is that most of your new devices and laptops now, if not all, with Windows, come pre-installed now with Windows 11. So I think that's actually a big factor. So... 30.82% last month in July or in July and for August 31.62%. And then moving on to Windows 10. Windows 10 has decreased again ever so slightly and this seems to be a trend now over the last couple of months. So uh, in July was 65% for August 64.17%. And if we head over to the chart, you can actually see that from September 2023, Windows 10 has been decreasing ever so slightly every month. And I think this chart gives us a good indication of that. While the opposite is happening with Windows 11, we can see that from September 2023, Windows 11 has been increasing ever so slightly. So interesting stuff going on here between Windows 10 and Windows 11, which currently are the only supported um operating systems um, of Microsoft. And at the bottom here, um, in the bigger scheme of things, not too much is actually changing. We can see that over the last year or so, with those unsupported versions of Windows, that not much is actually changed in the bigger scheme of things. So Windows 10, 64.17%, Windows 11, 31.62%. And that's the Global Stats Server results for the desktop windows version market share worldwide for august so thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one